Hey folks, this is Vint with Add to Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to quickly check out Mushroom Wars. It's important to note that what you're looking at here is a pre-release build, so everything that you're about to see is subject to change. Yes, um, as of the date of this recording, the game is due out in about 13 hours, but there may be a last-minute patch or something that will, uh, you know, address maybe a bug or two, I don't know, but just keep that in the back of your mind. This is a pre-release build, despite the fact that it's coming out very soon. So, uh, let's just take a look at the main menu here. I have not had a chance to play this yet. I just got my press key today. There's campaign, skirmish, online, help, options, and news. Under options, under video, you've got aspect ratio, resolution, full screen, and vsync. Sound, you've got sound and music sliders. I have the music off for the sake of the commentary and to prevent any sort of copyright issues. So I'm going to go ahead and try out the, uh, the campaign here. Not sure what I was trying to say. Clampaign. <laughs> Is that even a word? I don't think so. All right. Um, Maybe I'm in the mood for clam chowder, but I guess we'll start with mission one here and uh, maybe it'll teach us how this game is played and it looks like there's different difficulties easy Is there okay? I, I can I shoot I guess I can change that later on All right So I guess this is the story here Again, I have the music off so there may be some dialogue here that I'm missing all right, well, maybe we could just skip this. There we go, I'm just gonna skip this. To capture enemy buildings, you have to send your troops in there with the right mouse button. All right, capture the gray village. Uh, okay, so this is sort of like Euphoria and planets under attack. For those of you not familiar with that genre of games, basically there are fixed points on the map, and uh, if you capture a point, you're... Uh, base or that that particular point will start generating units and then you'll be able to capture other points and basically the last person standing wins usually but you know different games have different uh, rules and different things like that uh, you can travel between your villages using the left mouse button you can upgrade your buildings okay so how can I upgrade okay just I guess clicking on them a uh, double clicking okay Use the mouse wheel to change the number of troops you send. Okay. You can select two or more of your buildings. Press and hold the left mouse button. So I can do that. Okay. Oh, I see. So when I'm using the mouse wheel here, you, there's like four little dots next to my flag, my mouse cursor. I'm going to move it around real quick so you can see it. But uh, it looks like it's like there's a little dot there and then there's a big dot. Uh, but I can also go in between if I want to. Uh, I guess the big dot means I'll be sending most, if not all, of my troops. Whereas the little dot means I'll only be sending a little bit. So let's just uh, send what we have. Uh, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm going to send everything. That should That should hopefully be enough. Nice. Okay. Oh, that's loud. Okay, that's fine. Next level. Capture all enemy buildings. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just send everything I have here. Looks like he's upgrading, but sucks to be him because I'm attacking. All right, I'm going to go ahead and attack him up here. And then do that one there. And send that. Yep. Okay. This should wear him down a bit. Now, I don't know if he gets a defense bonus or how that works, but I'm just going to keep pelting him with units until he succumbs. Come on. Nice. Okay. Yeah. Upgrading from the get-go is a little risky because you, you risk, uh, you know, losing... Uh, you, you, you risk leaving yourself open to attack. I'm going to go ahead and capture this neutral one here real quick. I'm going to go ahead and upgrade these ones on the side just because there's not a lot of units there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and capture this. It looks like there's a neutral one. But I'm actually going to go after this this uh, enemy one over here. Oh, he's attacking the one in the middle. If I can send everything I have after he's done here, uh, he should be weakened. Alright, let's do that. I'm just going to try and, you know, weaken him a little bit here. Okay, he was weakened from that attack. So I'm going to try and just capitalize on that if I can. Yeah, it looks like it's working. He wasted some units against the neutral AI, so I, I came in and s just swept everything up. Now, I am down some units here, and I'm full on. I'm full here. Okay, it looks like I'm being attacked. I'm going to send some units this way to help out. And that, if they do capture this, I'll get it right back, hopefully. All right. 
That's okay. While, th while that's going on, I've got units back here generating. Right, I'm just going to send these units up here. That should keep them busy. And, yeah, I think this is game. I could have captured those neutral territories, but... No beggy. I got this. Oh, SOS, he's attacking. I'm going to go ahead and send some reinforcements here. A little trickster. All right, well, that's all right. We, we got this. We got this. At the last second, he, he tried a, a last second attack. Got him. I love games like this. I really do. It, it's... I mean, there's a strategic element to it, but it's also relatively simple. Alright, capture all enemy buildings. Oh, 180 versus 10. Okay, so I gotta upgrade these buildings if I want to survive. Okay, well, he's gonna be capturing some buildings here. I'm gonna have to, like... I'm gonna have to keep capturing these as, as best I can. Alright, SOS. So anything he gets, I'm gonna have to take back. Just, that's, uh, that's all there is to it. And in the meantime, I'll upgrade these other ones on the edge. There we go. Alright, yeah, let's just keep getting this back. Right, upgrade, 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 upgrade. Um, under attack there, let's go ahead and upgrade. It's alright, we got this. If we can just keep upgrading, uh, we'll amass enough troops to be able to take them out. I got this. We're good. I'm gonna go ahead and attack uh, a little bit just to put some pressure on him. There we go. We just captured that one. That's okay, we got this. Alright, we got the one in the middle. No problem there. He's got a last ditch effort here to capture this one, and I think it's over. There we go. Nice. Okay. Yeah, I'm really digging this game. Next level. Alright. These are towers. They shoot the enemies that march past them. Okay, so very similar to uh, planets under attack in that sense. And there's other games like that. Um, your towers will shoot more often if you upgrade them. So I want to capture that tower, I suppose. Let's go ahead and do that. We need to capture this thing before we lose too many troops. Come on, capture, capture, capture. Uh, okay. We almost got it. Luckily, he's not regenerating units, so I'm just going to let myself build up a little bit here. And I'll send everything I have. Hopefully, that's enough. Take it out. Take it. Come on, you got it. Go, 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 go. Go, little minions. Wow, they, this tower's tough. Alright, I need to stop sending troops and just wait a minute. Alright, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 18, 19, 20. I think I upgraded in the very beginning there, and I think that actually screwed me over. Alright, that should be enough. We've, we're, we're sending more than enough now, I think. There we go. Now I've got enough troops. Okay, now I don't think the towers generate units. So, I think what I'm going to do now is just let this build up, and then we'll attack this tower here. He's only got five troops there. So, I mean, we could send some troops from this one, too. Um, but I'd rather keep some here for defense. I don't know if he's going to attack or not. It doesn't look like it. I think this tutorial mission is just designed to, um, just to show you what towers are all about. But we'll go ahead and attack, sure. Let's go ahead and attack again. And we'll send some from here. There we go. So we've captured that now. And we could upgrade that, but I don't think we really need to. I think we could just attack with what we have and uh, finish blue off here. Hmm. Cool. What I'd really like to be able to do is upgrade my units across the campaign, make them tougher. That's what you could do in Planets Under Attack. You had sort of like a mini tech tree. It wasn't anything too advanced, but, uh, you know, you could upgrade your units and uh, make them more powerful for future levels. And that'd be, that'd be cool if there was something like that here. And there might be. I just ha maybe haven't gotten that far. All right. Let's go ahead and get this 30 here. 
Yeah, let's just you know, try and capture this neutral territory so we can generate more units. Come on. Oh, crap. All right. That did not work out the way I wanted it to. We lost a lot of units, and now the neutral AI is building back up again. All right. You know what? I'm going to restart this one because I, I don't like how that worked out. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to upgrade first, and then I'll attack the neutral because we just simply don't have enough. All right. So that's done. Let's go ahead and upgrade this further. Looks like you need 10 units to do that. Alright. There we go. Now I'm just going to simply wait a minute. Let my forces build up. Uh, it looks like he's got that tower. I may want to go after the tower first. Possibly. Yeah, let's do it. Let's just go after it. And then we'll go after the neutral AI after that. Okay, we got it. Okay, good. Alright. So he's going after that neutral AI there. I think what I'm going to do is if he's... Is he successful? No, he's not. Okay, I'm gonna get. I'm, I'm actually gonna go after him, and when he's done with neutral AI, is gonna wear him down. Then I'm gonna wear him down. There we go. Nice. Okay. So we basically wasted a bunch of units on the neutral AI. Now I've got 44 there. I should be able to hold out. I don't see why I shouldn't be able to. Yeah, I'm. I'm still good. Nice try though. All right, I'm probably going to want a few units here just, just to be on the safe side. Not a whole lot. All right, there's 60 units up here not doing anything. I'm going to go ahead and send uh, some here just to capture this. There we go. Nice, we got that. All right, now it looks like we now are under attack. I'm going to go ahead and send some units this way. Attack that. Yeah. That's all right. We've got some units incoming. We should be able to get that back. We've got 30 units here. I, I, I want to get a few more before we go after that tower, though. Oh, nice. We've got, we've got more than enough. We've got 71 units here. They should not attack me now, hopefully. Now, you know what? Let's go. They're reinforcing their tower. I'm going to go ahead and attack this one down here. Oh, looks like we exchanged there for a minute. All right, well, let's, let's just recapture this one. And, okay, we got that. Now let's go back and capture that. Okay, I've got 60 here that's not doing anything. I'm going to go ahead and just send these out. Just to, just to put some pressure on them. Oh, here we go. Let's just keep putting pressure on them. And he's still going. He's just going to keep reinforcing that tower. Maybe I should hold off on attacking it. You know what? Let's go after his other town. Here. Alright, SOS. Let's go ahead and reinforce that. Let's go ahead and reinforce that as well. Uh-oh. Uh, no, he's, he's, he, left some, he left his tower vulnerable. If I can go after it. There we go. Got his tower. Okay, now let's let's just keep that. I mean, I had to give up two villages to do it, but I got two towers now. All right, so let's just let's just see if we can capture as much back as we can. I'm just gonna send everything I have. All right, good, 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 good. Yeah, I don't think you're getting that. Not with. Well, he's sending everything he has. He might he might get it. Nope. Barely. Nope. Alright, reinforce. Oh, we got it back. That's alright, we got it back. Nice. Okay, we just got it back. Let's let's send more units to help. Alright, now we've got a bunch of units here not doing anything. Let's just send them over. Start attacking. Yeah, we There we go. Alright, this should yeah, this should do it. Yeah, good luck with that. Let's see how far you get. Nice. That's 
one down. Oh, we're wearing them out. Let's send the rest up here. Reinforce this point. Alright. Took a little longer than I wanted. Took a little longer than I wanted, but I got it done. I got it done. Alright, so let's go ahead and quit to the main menu. And looks like we're on the seventh level again. Uh, another six stars up here. I wonder if that's just the number of missions I've completed. Uh, there's also a skirmish mode. Uh, King of the Hill, Conquest, and Domination. So there's different modes, different maps to try out. Really cool. You can choose your difficulty down here. So that's available as well. Online coming soon. Okay, so that's not available yet. Again, this is pre-release build. Alright, so there you have it. A quick look at Mushroom Wars. Really liking it. If you want to see more gameplay, let me know. If you haven't already, subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out my official website, www.dadsgamingaddiction.com. This is Vince. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.